Well, tonight, a new push for a new sports team here in Las Vegas. Some they are seeing dollar signs, but others are asking, do we really need it? Well, good evening, everyone. I'm Todd Quinones. And I'm Trisha Keen. Soccer is once again a hot topic in our city. 13 Action News reporter Brian Callahan shows you how Major League Soccer and a new stadium could impact Las Vegas. This was the first attempt to get an MLS team in Las Vegas back in 2015, but concern over this Symphony Park site led MLS leaders to expand elsewhere. Now, four years later, Mayor Carolyn Goodman is ready to try again, this time targeting Cashman Field for that MLS stadium, hoping to reach her MLS goal. We've been practicing for this for three and a half years. We have all the paperwork, our ideas, our ways of helping to fund it. Mayor Goodman is clear the city has to look at any deal carefully, but is hopeful things will line up in the latest attempt to bring a major league franchise into the city limits. Something financial advisor Steve Budin says could have a big impact downtown. It's in a separate part of town from the other two stadiums, so it'll help diversify locally where people can go and watch a game. The previous effort to build an MLS stadium at Symphony Park in 2015 was derailed over opposition to public funding being pledged to the proposed 200 million 24,000 seat stadium. While funding for the current project hasn't been revealed, most seem to agree taxpayers want to see private investment. Clearly, if the stadium builder is not coming to the taxpayer for money, I would think they stand a much better chance of getting the project approved. While there are still a lot of hurdles, Buten says a new stadium would do wonders for the redevelopment of the neighborhoods around Cashman. You'll have people invest money down there and create restaurants and, and hotels and rental properties to help justify the visitation. With the new downtown Summerlin ballpark, the Las Vegas Raiders Stadium and T-Mobile Arena, is there a point where Las Vegas has too many sports venues? I think the fear of oversaturation is out there. I don't think we're there yet because the stadiums and some of these venues that are getting built really cater to niche fans. Another thing Buten says that could help a soccer stadium is the price of a ticket, which is typically lower for soccer games than it is for football or hockey games, which enables more fans to go to those games. Brian Callahan, 13 Action News.